OMG. Welcome back to my channel. So excited you are here. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn. I'm outside of the Walmart uh, bringing you my weekend warrior haul. If you're new and you just found me, so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, Thank you so very much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you. Definitely leave me a hello so I can say hi to you. So let me know if you got a weekend warrior bonus on Ibotta. I got five for 10 offers, which is an awesome one. I don't get that one all that often, but uh, I'll take it. I love it. And I'm working towards the big bonus. Now, I started this shopping on Wednesday night. Of course, whatever I purchased on Wednesday night, well, except for one thing, because the rebate was expiring. Um, I did hold my receipt and scan it Thursday morning to count for my weekend warrior. Um, I plan on bringing you this video on Thursday, but I don't think you're gonna see it until Friday because some of the deals, well, I just wasn't like feeling them. <laughs> and if I'm really, really not feeling it, I'm not gonna force myself to finish the bonus. Um, but I think I'm going to be able to do five for 10, especially if you're working on this big bonus. I'm going to tell you one thing that is super duper helpful to achieve your bonus uh, is the drugstores because I get multiple rebates. I bought a rebates from the drugstores every single week. I know some of y'all are not drugstore couponers. You don't like to shop at the drugstores. I don't even know how many rebates I've got this week, at least probably in April, uh, between Rite Aid, Walgreens, and CVS, I would say maybe 15 or 20 rebates. So it, it's a lot because you can repeat deals a lot of times at the drugstore. So anyways, that's super helpful. If you're just trying to do Walmart um, and you're feeling like, I'm not sure I can make the bonus, like, I totally get that. I don't think I would make my bonus if it was just at Walmart. I would really have to work for it. You can obviously do it. There's there's going to be weeks that are great deals, and there's going to be weeks that are maybe not so great deals. Um, but for me, the drugstores just help a ton. So anyways, enough of my rambling on. Let's go into Walmart um, and grab some deals. I might run to Kroger for one thing. I haven't decided yet. But if you enjoyed this video sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome nails. All right, we are in the Walmart and we still have double attaching on the um, Old Spice Total Body. One of them is in my list though. I thought it was gone. It's expiring in six hours. I did this shopping on, what day is it? Wednesday evening. You're not gonna see this till tomorrow, so it might be gone, but I'm gonna grab it. So it's $12.97. We have $3.44 back on Shopkick and then two $4 rebates over on Ibotta. It's going to make it like $1.53 and give me two rebates towards my Ibotta bonus. And I just realized even though I'm doing the shopping on Wednesday evening, I'm holding my receipt till tomorrow to see if I get a weekend warrior. I'm not going to be able to hold my receipt for that Old Spice because that other rebate will probably go away. So that's kind of a bummer, but it, it's what it'll all work towards my um, big bonus. So, all right, we're moving on. All right. This is a pretty spectacular deal. If your store has the new Clorox Sentiva, I'm looking at the bathroom, um, the toilet bowl cleaners, they're two sixty eight dollars each. I have a $5 and 10 cent back on my points, or you can use swag bucks. Swag bucks is probably $5 cause the conversion on my points is a little higher. Um, or ta-da or inbox dollars. They're all sister apps. It's a limit of twice per month you can do it. So if you wanted to get eight of them, you could do it, you know, four of them on my points, four of them on um, swag box, however you want to do it. I'm just going to grab four of them, which is going to make two of them 26 cents. I think I'll pop it up on the screen if I'm wrong. I don't know if I will like either one of these smells or not, but it doesn't really matter. If I can get cheap toilet bowl cleaner, I'm gonna grab it. So I'm just gonna max the deal out now and grab um, all four of them. 
All right, I already told you on Tuesday I was gonna do this Caesar deal because uh, I got Bonnie and Clyde, my mom's friend, who has dogs. Are these a dollar forty-six or are they a dollar twenty-eight? Why are these different? Uh, they like the filet mignon anyway, so I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna scan these on the Walmart app to make sure. But a dollar twenty-eight, I'm gonna buy three, and then I'll get back two dollars from Ibotta. And I am working towards a fetch bonus. Um, I, I can't remember how much I have to spend. This won't cover it, but it'll work me towards it. I think I'm going to get it for both um, mine and my husband's Ibotta. That'll knock out one rebate. And Bonnie and Clyde will have some nice little treats. All right, and this is why you should always check. Rebates can absolutely vary per account. One of my, my husband's Ibotta has this rebate. Mine does not. So I would not have got the $2 back for buying three. So Bonnie and Clyde are only getting three of them. Um, I'm going to pick this up again. I did already use my any cat food I think it attached to rebate. But let's make sure that this actually reset. It makes it super duper cheap. Where? Where? There we go. There we go. Um... Yes, so 50 cents back, and then I've got 40 cents. Is it 40 cents? Back on Shopkick? Something like that. So I make it like 14 cents or 16 cents. So I'm going to grab it. Okay, I ran into my friend Lisa here in the store. Thank you so much, Lisa. She let me know that these are on rollback for 97 cents, the little palm olives. Uh, there's $1 back on Shopkick, so it just makes them totally free. It's a limit of five. Um, she grabbed some already. I'm going to grab the last four that are left. It says on the Shopkick rebate, um, 20 ounce only, but then if you look at the products, it tells you what UPCs it's qualifying for, and it literally says the 8.4 ounce. So it's not a glitch. It lists this UPC code. Um, so why not? I'm going to go ahead and grab four of them for totally free. I hope you can find some too. All right. You know, if you've been following, I've been buying the little Minute Maid Frescas, the strawberry ones. My girls love them. Donna especially, but Viv really likes it too. Well, they do have it in the bigger size for $2.58. So I'm going to grab this and I have a $1 Ibotta rebate uh, for this product. So I will grab it. Darn it, I got all excited about those free palm olive. I meant to look for those Mr. Clean, the new, um, the new kind. So now I'm gonna have to go back over that way. All right, I'm gonna grab this again, the Captain Crunch. I told you guys that the rebate was gone because I was looking on my husband's I bought it for it and I didn't find it. Again, just another example of how rebates can vary. I have a 50 cent rebate on Captain Crunch. My husband's I bought it does not. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab I'm going to grab three of them because that'll count towards three rebates or $1.28. I have 50 cents back on Ibotta. All right, I was going to grab some Hellman's Vegan, um, which they have up here. Where was it? Right there. Uh, it's not attaching to the Ibotta rebate for $2 back, which is a bummer because I have a $3 coupon reimbursement. Well, I didn't even check and see if it was attaching on Shopmium. And $2 over on fetch now if you have never done the hellman's and you have these rebates there is two dollars on ibotta these are 5.98 three dollars over on shop Mium, which would make uh it 98 cents which is a great price i have so much free mayo that i'm not paying 98 cents for it right now um so that's a bummer i think this might be all i do tonight um i don't think there's anything else i'm hoping maybe some new rebates show up um, tomorrow, I'm going to go look for the Mr. Clean real quick. What in the world? The Mr. Cleans were always over here. I don't, I don't know where they are. I don't know. Who's tried Power Paste? Is it worth $10? I, I love the pink stuff. The pink stuff's amazing. It's cost like $5.97. I've, oh, it comes with a scrub mommy too. That's maybe why it's so much, but, um, they were all over here. Where did they move the dang Mr. Queen to? What the heck? I can't believe my store has no Mr. Queen anywhere. Let me look around for a second. 
Well, here it is in the cleaning aisle. It used to be over there on the wall. Anyways, I found it. Um, I think it's on these ultra foamy magic eraser. Um, they're $5.94 each and we have $6 back when you buy two. And I love magic eraser. I want to try these. So I'm going to go ahead and grab them. All right, this is all I'm going to grab for tonight. I will be back to do more shopping tomorrow. All right, we're back at Walmart. Thanks so much to Saving with Shay, who posted about this. The trial and travel size ponds. Only the pink ones, not the red ones, not the blue ones. Only the pink ones are attaching to a new $2 I bought a rebate. It's already on a timer, um, so it's going to go quick. Right now, I'm doing the shopping on... Tuesday? No, I'm not. It's Thursday. Thursday about noon. It says it's 22 hours left. You're not even going to see this video till Friday. Um, so it's, it might even be gone. Maybe I'll post a short, but anyways, I'm going to grab as many as I can. All right. This will probably be a deal. Not everybody wants to pick up, but this is the moisturizer that Viv uses, the Neutrogena Daily Facial Moisturizer, and she's almost out. Normally I get it at the drugstore, but we haven't had any coupons for this recently or a deal. So I'm going to grab it here. It's $10.97. I'll submit to I bought it for a $5 rebate, which is also on a dang timer. Um, and I have brand club surveys. I have four of them for $1.90. So it's going to make this about $4. So I'm going to grab it. All right, and of course I'm going to grab the Rockstar. I'll be doing it every week. Uh, it's an aisle rebate. It's buy two, earn back $5. They're $1.88 here at Walmart, so like a $1.20 moneymaker. Um, I'll leave the link down in the description box. You can do the rebate every other week. And because you guys have used my referral link, I get extra redemptions whenever somebody uses it. So I can do it a little bit more, but even without referral links, you can do it every other week. Okay, back in the Walmart, and I knew you guys wouldn't see the video before the pond steel was gone, but I posted a short just to hopefully alert most of you, and that didn't even work because <laughs> it went into people's list like so quick. It was gone within like, you couldn't even clip it within like an hour. Oh my gosh. All right, there really is not a whole lot of deals I was super excited about that were money makers. So I'm gonna focus on some food items. If I can save money on some groceries, that is what I'm going to do. So uh, we're probably gonna have a cost on this haul, which is fine, but I'm gonna save on my groceries. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and grab this Golden Star Jasmine Rice. It's 317. Uh, I have a coupon reimbursement over on Shopmium for 50 cents. Now remember, I kept scanning this and it wasn't picking it up. I've told you this before, but just in case you're new, if it has a QR code on the back of it, your shop me is going to pick that up. You've got to cover the QR code and scan it. I was like, why is this not working? And then I was like, oh, there's a QR code. Cover it. Then it will pick it up. So 50 cents back over on shop me And then I have a dollar and 50 cents on Ibotta. So that's going to make this two pound bag of rice. Uh, a dollar seventeen. I think that's fantastic. All right, next I'm going to pick up this Royal Ready to Eat. Ooh, I got a whole bunch of different flavors: Mexican style rice and street corn. Ooh, I bet that's good. Uh, let me scan this one just to make sure. I was gonna, just going to get the yellow rice, but I think I have a fifty cent. I bought a rebate, so. Scan, where are you, barcode? Why do I always do this? Try to film and, oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. Where's the camera? <laughs> There's the camera. Where's the bar, oh heavens, this is not working. Never mind. hang on. All right, I bought this one back. It did qualify for a rebate, but it was 25 cents where this one, scans for a 50 cent rebate. So I'm just going to grab that. It'll be $1.38. All right, next up, I'm going to grab this Martha White honey cornbread mix. It looks like, I don't know if we have different rebates for other kinds, um, but I, my store only has one. So that's lucky. So it's $1.12. I have 25 cents back on Ibotta. And then I have brand club surveys, four of them for $1.90 back, which is going to make this a little money maker. 
I forgot to tell you yesterday when I was here and I was gonna grab the magic eraser and I got up to the register, I had grabbed one three pack and one five pack. So one was 5.49, one was 8.49. I did not mean to do that. Um, so I had her take it off. Um, I'm trying to decide. It looks like there might be some more three counts back there, but of course I can't reach that. That's way on the top shelf. But I found one that I could reach. And then this one also qualifies. Do I want to get this? This definitely will make my haul. I think I'm going to be at like, I don't know, maybe a 3 or $4 cost right now. But if I get these, that's going to be another $5 in cost. What do I do? What do I do? I think I'm not going to get them. And this deal, it's gone. <laughs> I feel, I feel, I always feel so bad when I share deals that you can't even do anymore. The Shopkick is gone for this. Hopefully you already had seen it and you already had did it. Um, if you wanted to on those little palm olives that are on rollback. But anyways, um, all right. So I think this is going to be it. I've been to Walmart so much this month. <laughs> I'm going to go check out with these and then we're going to head over to Kroger and finish up my weekend warrior. Um, and then we'll meet at the kitchen table. Oh, P.S. I am planning on being one rebate short. Um, so I am going to purchase a gift card. I already showed this, but you can purchase a gift card. It's right on the home page. Um, right here, uh, gift cards. And you just find the store that you're looking for. I'm going to search Z to A. Walmart should pop right up. There it is. You have to purchase at least $20. I'm not going to have $20 in product here but that's okay um the gift card will save right in ibotta so i can use it next time and i just update my balance right when i purchase it so again you can purchase this with a credit card you already have on file or you can use your balance if you have money in your ibotta account i think that's what i'm gonna do today and then that will give me my last rebate i need for my bonus all right let's uh head over to kroger now all right, keeping up with the food theme, we are now at Kroger, and I'm gonna get grab some Lucky Charms. We got a mega uh, event sale, so it's buy five items that are on the mega. You can mix and match, and you get a dollar off each item. So I'm going for some Lucky Charms, because it's EJ's favorite, and I'm on my last box. So they're gonna ring up for $1.99 each, which will be $3.98. I have a dollar off two digital coupon, so I'll pay $2.98. Submit to Ibotta for a dollar back for buying two, and then I have a Kroger cash back for a dollar back for buying two. It's gonna make them 49 cents a box. And then I also grabbed this Mentos gum at checkout. It's two dollars, and my husband's shop kick has two dollars back, which will make it free. I really wanted to grab more than one, but my store is out once again because I do have a fetch rewards bonus. I think it's a dollar back when I spend five but I'll just grab this one pack for free. Next up, these little popcorn seasonings are on the mega. So normally $3.99, they'll ring up for $1.99. And I've never tried these. So um, the cheddar and jalapeno, I was like, I don't, I don't know about that. <laughs> I'm going to grab two of the white Parmesan, one of the, it's like a cheese one, I think nacho cheese or something. And then I saw one... I think it's garlic and Parmesan back here. It must be good because there's only one left. Here it is. So I'm grabbing four of them. I have 50 cents back on Ibotta for each one. And then I also have a Kroger cash back of 50 cents back for each one. So they'll end up costing me 99 cents each. And this will be four rebates towards my bonus. All right, this next item is not an Ibotta rebate, but I decided to grab it anyways because it's such a great deal. These Mother's um, Frosted Animal Crackers, they're normally $4.69. They're on the Mega for $1.99. My girls love them. My grandbabies love them. And I have a Savings for You coupon for $1.50 off of one, which makes them just $0.49. Cents. All right, I've been working on my Weekend Warrior for my Ibotta and my husband's I bought it and I think I completed them both. Let's head to the kitchen table and go over my final cost. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with this end of the week rebate haul. Oh my gosh. I started it on Wednesday evening and uh, 
I mean, I guess it didn't take me that long because I finished it last night. <laughs> One deal I did miss at Kroger that I totally would have thrown in. Now, there's lots of great deals happening at Kroger, as usually there are every single week. But just, I usually separate, like, my grocery deals from my couponing deals. Um, thank you so much to Amy. She had sent me a message. The Killer, Dave's Killer Bread. Um, there is a Kroger cashback and an Ibotta rebate on the single snack bars. My store doesn't carry those. But the larger boxes of the Killer's Dave Bread snack bars, my store does carry. And they are on the Mega. So they would ring up for $4.49, I think. We have a $2 digital coupon. And the reason I didn't look at it is because my Ibotta has a $1 rebate. Well, my husband's has a $2.50 rebate. So again, we talked a lot in this video about how rebates can vary per account. So that would have been a freebie. I totally would have added that in with my Mega. So check and see if your store has that and if you have the $2.50 coupon. You can already see we have products that have been opened. The juice, uh, the popsicle things that Donna wanted. So anyways, I honestly at the beginning of the month had no intention of working on both on my Ibotta and my husband's Ibotta, but it appears that's what I'm doing now. <laughs> The deals, although a little bit slower this week at the end of the week, um, I did see some things reset today. Colgate reset, and it's a little higher rebate on Ibotta. So I totally would have done that had I waited till today. Um, but anyways, I'm working on two. So I would love to hear where you are at. I know some of y'all have already finished your dang bonus, which is awesome. So my Ibotta, I separated these by my Ibotta, my husband's Ibotta. Um, I need 93 for $25. And after this haul, I'm at 56. So I'm more than halfway. And it's not even halfway through the month. So I need 37 more. For my husband's Ibotta, I need 103 rebates for $35. And after this haul, I'm at 75 rebates. So you only need 28 more, which is awesome. So this was the haul I did for my Ibotta. I had um, eight rebates here, but I had two from the drugstore. So I have a gazillion receipts because I did the shopping all on different days. And when I did some shopping on Wednesday, I wasn't sure which Ibotta that I would be submitting to, which was going to get the better weekend warrior. Mine got a five for 10. My husband's got a five for 18 just for reference. So, uh, Captain Crunch is only on my Ibotta and I added the Beneful. Um, then I got the Neutrogena moisturizer and the three ponds on this one and two Rockstar. And then this one was the Palmolive and the Sentivas and then the, um, Old Spice body spray. I had to submit that on Wednesday evening. So it didn't even count for this bonus. Um, because that rebate was expiring. So total that I paid, it was all Walmart for my Ibotta. Total that I paid was $51.81. I ended up getting back $5 from Rockstar, a total of $21 from Ibotta and hit my $5 Weekend Warrior, a total of $7.80 from Shopkick, which was for the Old Spice and those Palm Olives and the Beneful. $1.90 from Brand Club for the Neutrogena. Um, something weird happened with my points when I scanned my receipt. It gave me the credit for all the Clorox Sentiva. And then it said, hooray, we found an extra deal, which was like palm olive. And they gave me an extra 17 points, which is an extra 10 cents. Never had that happen before. So I got back $10.30 from my points. And then I do have the Rockstar bonus on Fetch Tracking. So I was able to hit that for the second time and got another $2.50 back from Fetch. So I paid $51.81 for this little bitty stuff here. And I got back $53.50. So it was a dollar and 69 cent moneymaker. So awesome. Then this is all of my husband's stuff. So again, I have a gazillion receipts 
This is one with the five ponds. Um, I know that went super quick and not everybody could have done that. This was the Beneful. This is where I had tried to purchase the um, Mr. Clean and realized I grabbed two different packages, so I had her void it off. These were the Caesars, which is only on my husband's Ibotta. Um, this one was the Minute Maid Juice. This is the last one I did last night with uh, four food items. And then this was my Kroger receipt. And of course, I went to a dang machine uh, where it didn't print the receipt out good. So when I submitted my receipt to Ibotta, it didn't pick up the Lucky Charms. I did have to add it. It went through just fine. Um, but it was pending for about 12 hours. Uh, so for my husband's, I paid $41.38. Isn't that insane? All of this was $41.38, and this stuff over here was $51.81. It's kind of crazy. All right, so $41.38, I ended up getting back $5 from Rockstar, a total of $19.25 in rebates from Ibotta, plus the $0.10, cent, which is the cash back I earned from purchasing the gift card to finish out the last rebate I needed. Hit my $5 weekend warrior bonus. Uh, total back from Kroger cash back was $3. That was for the popcorn seasoning and the Lucky Charms. It did take about an hour for my KCB offers to disappear, but they did disappear. Um, total of $1.40 back from Shopkick. That was just for the gum and the Benefils. Um, submitted to Shop Meum for $0.50 cents back on the Golden Star Jasmine Rice, that went through in like 10 minutes. Uh, $1.90 from Brand Club for the Martha White products. So I paid $41.38 and I got back $36.15. So my cost was $5.23 for all of this stuff. And I got a ton of food items. So I'm super duper happy. Plus, I added in the animal crackers, which I didn't even have a rebate for. So $5.23 cost, $1.69 moneymaker. Everything on the table ended up costing me $3.54. And that Neutrogena by itself after the $5 rebate and the $1.90 from Shopkick was a $4 cost. So to get everything... For $3.54, I think is absolutely fantastic. So there you go. That is what I have for the end of the week rebate haul. I might even be able to, we'll see what next week brings. I mean, we still have two weeks in the month to finish this, but I might be able to finish. I only need 28 rebates on my husband's. I bought, I might be able to finish it next week, depending on what rebates we can get at the drugstores and then whatever shows up at Walmart or Kroger. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much and I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.